Hey guys, I'm Kyle, an entrepreneur and adventurer from Washington State. I've been building a camera accessories company for the past 12 years, and it's taken me on adventures all around the world. This has fueled my passion for overlanding and camping with my family in my rooftop tent. Unfortunately, this past year when I was hunting, some jack wagon took a sawzall to my rack, stole my tent, my trailer, and everything in my truck after they bashed out the windows. Super bummer, but it got me thinking about if there was a better way that I could camp without having to pull a trailer. Rooftop tents are amazing, don't get me wrong, but you can't stand up in them and you can't cook in them. So I did some research and I found this amazing market of lightweight truck campers that basically combine a canopy and a rooftop tent to make a mini camper on your truck bed. Now the only problem is that they cost ten dollars to $12,000 and you have to drive to their factory to go pick them up. So my business brain kicked on and I set out with the goal of introducing a new lightweight truck camper at half the price of the campers on the market that ships directly to your home that you can assemble with a friend in less than three hours. So after six months of prototyping and design, we're finally ready to actually make these things. I'm inviting you to come on this journey with us to bring our camper to market. So follow our progress on social media, sign up on our website at lonepeakoverland.com for free shipping when we launch. We're gonna be opening reservations soon. The next part of the video is a CAD walkthrough. I don't have an actual production prototype yet. It's still three to four weeks out, but you guys have been asking tons of questions, so I wanna give you something to look at. Before we get there, there are two rules. One is that walk arounds have to be done at an epic location like this requirement. That's why I'm out here and it's almost dark, but we're doing it and it's on a computer. Rule number two is that you need to enjoy a very tasty craft brew often. So I have my Bodhi, let's get to it. All right, so before we actually get into the nitty gritty details of the design, we have to talk about the philosophy of the design. This is super important. So most truck companies use a design that has folded, bent, laser cut sheet metal that's welded or riveted together, and it makes it really hard to achieve economies of scale. So we chose to think a little differently. We're using aluminum extrudes for the frame that are bolted together with solid billet corner pieces. All the panels are made out of aluminum composite material, which is super easy to mill. So with that combination, all we have to do is change three dimensions in our CAD model, and it spits out aluminum cut lengths and milling files for our CNC machine to cut, and is super easy to assemble. This design also allows us to hit our crazy low price point because aluminum is a fairly stable commodity and the extrusion process is the cheapest process to get aluminum into a given shape. All right, let's finally talk about features. Most companies will charge you thousands just to add side access doors and windows. So we decided to take a different approach. All those features come standard on our camper so that you can spend your money on our suite of accessories we have planned instead of kitting out your camper just to make it usable. All right, let's talk about one of my favorite features and most important thing is the mattress. It has to be comfy. So we have a full four inch thick mattress. It's dual density, meaning two different layers of two inch thick foam. It has gas struts on the bottom so you can push it out of the way so that when you're inside of your camper, you can actually use your entire truck bed to pack gear and organize things. It also comes with a ladder attached to it, making it really easy to push out of the way and also to get up into. All right, so the next feature is what we call a pass-through space. Let's look at it here. So a pass-through space is basically from the end of your bed to your tailgate. And a lot of companies don't even have this. You have to move panels out of the way if you actually wanna have living space inside of your camper. We have a full three feet of pass-through space for you to set up gear in and to live in, making the camper much more comfortable. Another really cool thing is that our pivot for the bed can move towards the tailgate. So if you're a tall guy and your feet are always hitting the wedge, don't worry about it. You can move the bed away from the wedge and have clearance for your feet. Looking at our design, a single latch opens up the side panels and allows you to access everything inside of your truck bed. Since the camper is optimized for side access storage, you don't wanna to have to get into your truck bed to get gear out. 
So we created something called the Gear Vault. This will be available as an accessory for the camper and has things called gear bags that mount to the molly panels. It's a soft sided bag that allows you to organize and secure your gear. Another awesome feature is the tent. It's currently being sewn in our shop right now. I'll post some videos on social soon. It has a waterproof, breathable polyester fabric that has a PU coating, making it super waterproof. And as you can see in the rendering, we actually have a rear awning built in. So the purpose of this, I live in Washington State, it's rainy a ton, and I hate being trapped inside of a tent when the weather is bad. So you can actually open up the rear door and there's actually, it's a different material for the top. It's actually a solid vinyl so that the material doesn't wet out, but that sheds the rainwater and you can have airflow even in bad weather conditions. All right, so I hope that is a decent rundown of the CAD, gives you a little bit of things to look at. We have a ton of accessories planned for this thing. It's almost dark out right now. So we're gonna go into them in another video. Uh, some of the accessories though are a uh, full suite of lighting accessories that you can control with your phone from the light bar to interior lighting to awnings, rear awning, a side awning that has lighting built into it. Again, controlled with your phone, air compressors. Oh, good heavens, we're working on a camp kitchen system. So the whole vision for Lone Peak is that we can help you camp better with more confidence and more comfort in the backcountry. So keep following along. Email me at kyle at Lone Peak Overland if you have any questions at all. And thanks for watching.